Australia has said today that it will ban TikTok on all government devices due to national security concerns. Australian Prime Minister Anthony Albanese has agreed to the ban after completing a review conducted by the Home Affairs Department. The ban is slated to come into effect as soon as it would be feasible enough to implement. The exemptions would be allowed on a case-by-case -case basis subject to security precautions. The announcement comes amid heightened concerns in Australia about alleged espionage and interference by Beijing, which led Canberra to pass sweeping anti-foreign interference legislation and slap restrictions on Chinese firms, including Huawei. The country has now joined a growing list of Western nations cracking down on the Chinese-owned app. Australia now joins France, Belgium and the European Commission in announcing a ban on the app. With Australia's ban, all members of the so-called Five Eyes Intelligence Sharing Network, which consists of Australia, Canada, the United States, Britain and New Zealand, have banned the app from government devices. In 2020, India was the first country to impose a nationwide ban on TikTok and other Chinese-owned apps. TikTok is a company based in Beijing and is owned by ByteDance Limited. Typically, the app, which has more than a billion users, is used to share light-hearted videos. Initially, many governments saw the app as an efficient tool to connect with a younger demographic which is seen as hard to reach through traditional media channels. However, cyber security experts have repeatedly warned that the app could be used to harvest user data that is then shared with the Chinese government. Previously, TikTok has alleged that the ban being initiated by Western nations is rooted in xenophobia. However, last December, the company conceded that the app had indeed been used to collect user data to spy on journalists. Earlier this year, Australia had announced that due to security concerns, Chinese-made surveillance cameras would be stripped off from the offices of politicians. This ban underscores growing worries that China's government could use the Beijing-based company to harvest users' data to advance its political agenda, thus undermining Western security interests. Subscribe to One India channel and never miss an update.